Okay, explorers, are you ready? We are going to enter the gates of Jurassic Park and search for dinosaurs in the sand. Cool. Okay, let's start digging for dinosaurs. Wow. This is going to be awesome. Uh-oh. What is this here? Oh, I think we found something, guys. Quick. We got to bring the brush. We have to be careful. Oh, wow. Check that out. That is so cool. That has to be a feathered T-Rex. Wow. Okay, but let's be careful taking this guy out. Whoa, he looks huge. Check this guy out. Wow, that is awesome. What do you guys think? Check him out. Okay, cool. <laughs> this guy's huge. Okay, so we got him all out. Let's go ahead and pull him out. Cool! It's a giant feathered T-Rex. Okay, so we'll set him there and let us keep looking. Hmm. Gotta be more dinosaurs in here. Oh, I think we got something. Cool. What is this? Okay, what do we got here? Oh, it's definitely an herbivore. Can you guys see what it is? Wow, you are correct. It's a sauropelta. And since we got it out, let's go ahead and take it fully out of the sand. Cool. Okay. Let's keep on digging. It's gotta be something else here. Oh, look, look, look. I think we have something. Oh, we gotta be careful. We don't wanna break it. Oh, wow. Check that out. I'm not sure what it is yet, but we will find out soon. Oh, wow. Cool. Check him out. Ooh, can you guys guess what this is? It is a giant feathered dinosaur. You are correct, it's a Uteranus. Wow, let's go ahead and remove him from the sand. Cool, that is awesome. Let's see what else we could find. We found three already. Okay, so what do we got? Hmm. Anything here? seeing anything yet oh 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 Ooh, we have something here it looks kind of big too wow okay let's check it out what could this one be oh there's his head cool Ooh, this one is definitely an herbivore it looks like it has some type of a uh, duck bill head on it. Can you guess what it is? Yes, you are right. It's a Gorbosaurus. Cool. So let's go ahead and pull this up. And guys, uh, if you keep watching, we're going to set these up in an awesome dinosaur zoo. And I will give you some really cool facts about them. Wow. Okay, well, let's keep looking. Okay, anything else here? Hmm. Oh, oh, oh! Wow, we have something here. What is that? Ooh, it's got like yellow and black stripes on it. Cool, what could it be? Huh. Oh, it's a long one. Wow, check that out. It's got one evil looking head over there oh can you guys already guess what this is oh wow that is so cool oh i like this one wow 
Okay, can you guys guess what that is? You are correct! It's a Tylosaurus! That is part of the Mosasaurus family. Wow! Like I said, keep watching to see the dinosaur zoo and some awesome facts! Okay, so so far we have found five awesome dinosaurs. There's gotta be more. Come on, let's keep looking. Wow. Oh, 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 wow, what is this? Oh, this is something big. Wow, how cool. Oh, I like this one. Check out its skull. What could this one be? Oh, wow, look at him, he's huge. Oh, I like this one. He's definitely carnivore. I mean, look at his teeth. And this is one long dinosaur. Hmm. Are you guessing what it is? This guy is actually bigger than the T-Rex. That should give you a clue. He is gigantic. You are correct. It's a Gigantosaurus. Wow. And guys, uh, these these dinosaur toys were sent to me by my friends at Safari Limited. So they are awesome. If you want to check out their website, they got some really cool dinosaurs. Okay guys, so we have six dinosaurs here. Let's go ahead, give some cool facts about these guys, and set them up in our dinosaur zoo. Awesome! Let's get started. <laughs> The name Sarapelta means shield lizard. It has an intimidating armor of bony studs and shoulder spines. It was one of the most spectacular dinosaurs of its time. It belonged to a group called the Nod Nodosaurids, which were part of a larger group called Ankylosaurs. It had a spiny body and it was an herbivore. Really cool dinosaur. Check out those big spikes on its back. And the Euteronis, its name means feathered tyrants. It could run as fast as a T-Rex. It was three cars long and it weighed as much as a hippopotamus. These dinosaurs lived in what we would call modern day Asia. They were about 30 feet long and weighed about 4,000 pounds. They hunted in packs and they were carnivores. This is one of the first dinosaurs they found, the fossils, with feathers. Cool, check this guy out. Okay, and the Gryposaurus, its name means Curvy Nosed Lizard. This was the class of duck build, build dinosaurs. Uh, he was about 30 feet long and weighed about 6,000 pounds. He belonged to the dino class, Ornithopoda, and he was a plant eater that lived dur during the late Cretaceous period in North America, Argentina, and South America. The funny thing was when these were attacked, 
for a brief period of time, it could run on its back legs. I mean, think of a dinosaur this size running on just two legs. That would be hilarious. Okay, Tylosaurids. Its name means knob lizard. It lived in the shallow seas of North America during the Cretaceous period. It was about 35 feet long and weighed up to 14,000 pounds. Its diet was fish, turtles, and reptiles. This guy was the largest of the class of mosasaurs. So this guy was huge, he was vicious, and he terrorized the seas during his reign. He is really cool. I do love Mosasaurus, guys. Okay, and here we have the Gigantosaurus. Its name means Giant Southern Lizard. It was a carnivore with a very small brain, about 40 feet long, and weighed about 26,000 pounds. So it was about the size of two elephants. This dinosaur was actually bigger than the T-Rex. Wow, this guy is really cool. And he lived during the late Cretaceous period. Okay, and here we have a feathered T-Rex. Many scientists believe T-Rexes actually had feathers to help protect them from the elements. The name of the T-Rex means Tyrant Lizard. These were large carnivores. They, li they lived about 30 years. Its arms were too short to reach its mouth. It lived in North America in river valleys and forests, and it could eat about 500 pounds of meat with one bite. So weighing 16,000 pounds, these guys were huge, but they were not quite as big as the Gigantosaurus. Wow, cool. Okay guys, time to set up our awesome dinosaur zoo. So let's go ahead and start placing dinosaurs in there. Ooh, we'll have the big feathered T-Rex coming out of there. Then you have the Gigantosaurus there ready to fight him. Ooh, cool. Tylosaurus will go here in the water. Wow, and then we'll have to put the herbivores here separate so the carnivores don't eat them and then we got some other dinosaurs joining us these are uh jurassic park knockoff dinosaurs so we have uh triceratops there we have a cool t-rex here and then we have an awesome ankylosaurus and a uh, Brachiosaurus. So there we have our dinosaur zoo. Let's go ahead and take a look at them. Wow, so here we've got two herbivores in there. Over there we have the four largest carnivores there ready to take down anything in their path. You've got the Tylosaurus and three herbivores over here so our dinosaur zoo is complete how cool is that wow
Okay guys, if you enjoy this video, please go ahead, click like, drop me comments. Wow, I love making these videos for you guys. This is my job guys, I love doing my job. I love the fact that you guys are watching because my kids love these dinosaurs. I do got six kids guys and they love dinosaur toys. So, you are helping to support my family and I want to thank you. I want to thank you for being awesome and say I will see you tomorrow. Wow, guys, that was a lot of fun. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure you click subscribe and the thumbs up button down below the video. And today's secret word is the word. Go ahead and put that in the comment section down below the video. I'll know you're a member of my club. If you look to the video ends, there's an awesome end curve. There's a lot more fun videos. And I will see you soon. Click the boxes below for a lot more fun videos. And if you want to see even more, go ahead and click the subscribe button.